Welcome to Festool TV. My name is Frank and today I'd like to present to you Festool's vacuum clamping system. What is a vacuum clamping system? It's a clamping system whose functionality is based on suction pressure and that allows you to fasten and process work pieces, regardless if they are large pieces such as board materials, strips or even solid wood. I'm sure you're all familiar with the problems that arise when you need a clear working area but have to use various clamps that attach in the working surface preventing clear access. So what's our vacuum clamping system comprised of? What does it mean in practical terms? How do you work with it? First of all, we have here a vacuum pump which you can easily connect to the system through our plug-it mechanism. Then we can connect the vacuum hoses. Next, we have an on-off switch and then also a small pressure gauge which lets you verify that the vacuum is appropriate for the application. And here we have the core of the system. This includes the clamping unit itself, which is delivered in a sustainer along with the vacuum pump. This setup gives you a great deal of mobility. You can take the whole system with you to a construction site, use it for the construction of trade fair stands, for kitchen installation, etc. And you can clamp the necessary parts on site. One thing that's particularly noteworthy about this clamping unit is that it has the ability to attach itself to a non-porous material. This means that if you have a smooth surface, such as a table or a workbench, you can attach the entire vacuum clamping unit directly onto the surface by means of this rubber seal at the bottom. In this way, you don't need any additional fastening parts. Of course, the whole thing will only work if I connect it. First, we have a connection for the vacuum pump. This can be installed quickly and easily through an easy click mechanism. Then we also have this foot valve which allows me to stop the vacuum so that I can exchange or replace work pieces. Now let's switch on the pump and I will show you how it works. With this green slide switch, we can now suspend or activate the vacuum so that the clamping unit is clamped onto the table or board. This lets me put the clamping unit in different positions. On the other hand, here on the top I have a disc, which lets me safely attack even larger work pieces. If I need to rotate the work pieces, this is not a problem. Just loosen the knob on the side, and now you can process the work pieces on all sides. If I wish to process the edge here, I can also loosen the whole work piece by disengaging this clamping lever. And now I have full freedom to put the work piece in a different position in order to work on the edges. Of course, there's also the problem of dealing with smaller work pieces. In such cases, we install another disc. Before that, I cut out the vacuum through my foot valve and can now remove the workpiece. Take, for example, this small workpiece. As you can see, there are different vacuum discs for different workpiece sizes. Here you will also find everything you need for the various application scenarios. In our case, I'm now going to install a small shoe for processing the strip. First, I tilt the disc forward. Then a small pin in the rear section becomes visible. I lift the pin and thus release the locking mechanism. 
Next, I turn the knob and now I can replace the disc during ongoing operations. I add the smaller shoe, lock it and rotate it into a horizontal position. Now I can put smaller work pieces on the setup and process them. If you find it easier to work plain or grind items in this position, this is no problem at all. Of course, you can also lower the whole thing if you want to process edges, for example. As you can see, this system offers you quite a few options. But sometimes you may also wish to process much bigger work pieces. For example, in order to cut hinges or lock cases into doors, in such cases, it's possible to connect a second clamping unit to the same vacuum pump. Thus, I would have two clamping units side by side here. I can release both of them with the same foot valve. This allows you to clamp doors and process them on all sides and, if necessary, tilt them up so you can install hinges or lock cases. Now let's detach everything. If you also have such an MTF, multi-function table, you also have the option of mounting this vacuum clamping unit on this table. By using this adapter plate, which is inserted into the profile by means of a sliding nut, you can now position the clamping unit and, if necessary, swing it under the table. This means that whenever you need the table without the clamping unit, you can just swing the unit away and then swing it back later. As you can see, there are many ways to fasten and process parts with this vacuum clamping system. It is simply quick, economical and efficient. I hope you enjoyed getting to know the vacuum clamping system. And I look forward to meeting you next time. Frank.